bueno, ya subió de por sí. Ya subió el precio. Eh, yo tengo 20 años eh, en esta propiedad y jamás me imaginé de que ese cambio vendría, ¿verdad? Ahora este, ya están muy caras y se espera mucho más caras en el futuro cuando abran el estadio. Eh, estoy a favor por el cambio que viene, pero también este, nosotros nos hemos favorecido, los dueños de las propiedades. Y los inquilinos son los de que van, están batallando con su, con su renta, ¿verdad? The major impact we have right now is negative and it's already happening. The stadium's not even being done built, but the rents are going way too high for what people have been paying. For example, where I used to live, we had to move out because I, I lived in a one bedroom, one bath, and it was at 800 and it rose above a thousand. I'm not sure where it's at now, but I know that, you know, one bedroom apartments go way above a thousand, five hundred or six hundred. And so we had to move to a smaller place where it's just, you know, a thousand dollars and we can barely afford that. And I'm sure that a lot of people are going through the same thing. And even businesses around on Manchester Boulevard, they have to close down just because, you know, the rent is going up. And these are mom and pop shops who have been there for a long time and they're not making enough to cover the rent. Traffic has gotten significantly worse, especially the two major streets around it on Century and Manchester, especially because of... The, of the construction even on those streets to make it look better just so that it blends in well with the stadium. My honest opinion, I feel like it was not necessary here. I feel like what was necessary was to use the land that we are using for the stadium, for community services, for the people who have already been here or build you know, affordable housing for us to prioritize the people here. I feel like we could have brought more money into LA if that's what they wanted by using it in a different city who was already fine and wealthy without having to displace the people there. At least uh, 100% Last, uh, last time, uh, if you're talking about five, six years ago, they were in the 300,000, right now they're 600. Well, it's harder because uh, 10, 15 years ago, there was not so many requirements. Everybody could buy with stated income. Now you have to have down payment, you have to have good credit, you have to have a good job, so it, it is harder. Mm -hmm. 